Hey everyone, Electropolitan here, bringing you an F-Zero GX song looping tutorial. So I'm going to be go going over the basics of how to loop a song, uh, using Audacity, and the PES sound converter. You could use um, Brawlbox, there it is, uh, import a song and set loop points with it, which is handy, and Smash Custom Music has a lot of songs already on here which have loop points that you can use and now put into GX because they're AX format, so it's great, it's awesome. However, um, using, because of final laps, you know, you'd want it to speed up and maybe have a guitar solo, so eh, this is more ideal, and you don't want to have an intro of a song. I mean, I'm sure many of you guys are going to be doing time trials and all that, having to redo the same stage over and over again, which starts the song over and over and over again, sadly. Um, so yeah, you definitely don't want to hear the intro over and over. You just want to get to the good stuff, I imagine. So, um, I was originally going to use a Red Out song, but that song doesn't loop, so it's much harder to loop. I'd have to do it myself, <laughs> which, um, yeah, doing your own loop is much harder. It's like trying to loop orchestral music. I mean, if it has a chorus, it's much, much easier. So we're going to do that. We're going to be using Big Blue's theme from Melee. I'm going to, um... I'm gonna use the compressor on it so the lower sounds are brought up the higher sounds are a little bit uh, smushed and by sounds I don't mean frequent yeah I don't mean frequencies I mean noise level but so I'm just gonna turn that up a little bit increase the amplification a little bit oh well, clipping yeah clipping yeah. I right, just so yeah it should be fine so I could just let's see <laughs> I could remove the intro, but I do like it, and it's not that long. It's only 15 seconds. The song is pretty short by itself. Actually, this will work perfectly. Okay. I'm gonna do it at a very noticeable spot. Yeah. I'm zooming in with control and the mouse wheel to really, really zoom in to each individual sample. All that. And you can hear it. Uh, judging by this I can tell there's a new instrument or a new big change oh, missed it okay so I'm gonna go once again to the 0 DB mark and remove everything here the beginning shift ta shift space to loop it or to hear a loop song I'll hold uh, the arrow key There you go, perfect. So now I'm gonna control shift E or file ent uh, file whatever uh, <laughs> export, and I'll just export it. Um, now getting Audacity by itself, you need you can't export MP3, so you'll have to get a lame uh, converter or something. Uh, which sadly, what's its face? Pass sound converter only takes MP3s. I mean, it could take wave, but it won't loop pretty freaking annoying so is that my mp3 oh did i overwrite it oh, okay Whatever, just to be safe i think i did <laughs> okay i just drag it there nice and easy yes we want it to loop and just make it the source i don't know where else it'll go yay so where'd it go actually i have some stuff here okay <laughs> 80. So, uh, yeah, the song is only a minute, but it says two minutes here because it loops before you. So that's what you hear in game. I know it's loop like that. I hear it looks more than that. This is Foobar 2000, if you want to preview uh, ADX files. And if you want to know what to replace, oop, oh, I didn't need to get rid of that, okay. If you want to know what to replace, open up your root folder, uh, SND, ADX, and there you go. So let's say I want the, this big blue theme to go over big blue, which is ocean. <laughs> have it as that, okay. Um, just for the sake of an example. So rainbow. So uh, I'll F two, copy. 
remove it, rename, paste, and there you go. Easy peasy. Just that simple. Uh, uh, I'm going to undo that right afterwards. But if your songs are really big, then you'll probably probably want to remove stuff in the character BGM, which are the character themes. For example, oh, it's a really bad one. Uh, well, Captain Falcon is the longest, so you'd probably want to remove that. I mean, it's 10 megabytes. Jeez. That is really long. So whatever you want to remove, just to save space. Not When I mean remove, I mean replace it with a very tiny blank file so you save a lot of room. Only yeah, GameCube ISOs can only be like a gig, what, gigabyte and 30 megabytes? 1.3 gigs? I don't know what the hell I said it like that. Um, but yeah. So you could have loop points if you convert it to Brawlbox and then upload to Smash Custom Music or simply just download a song from Smash Custom Music. But if you don't want it to and you want final lap stuff, then this is the way to go. Um, hopefully that explained everything pretty well. Uh, if not, post the comments. Bye.